God, you tell us in your word, uh, you is our refuge and our strength. Uh, you is our present help, oh God. Uh, you is our only hope this morning. Uh, Lord, we give ourselves into your hands. Uh, glory to God, hallelujah. Master Potter, Master Builder, you are the author, you are the finisher of our faith. Uh, continue to bind us together as cards that cannot be broken uh, oh glory to god uh, lord jesus this is mountain moving fasting uh, this is another first wednesday oh god uh, we are the certain kind oh god uh, the certain kind coma uh, and the certain kind sometimes uh, are so hard to remove uh, but this morning oh god uh, uh, we started out from Sunday, some of us, God. Uh, and here we are still this morning uh, in fasting and in prayer, oh God. Uh, say, Lord, we need your help. Uh, say, Lord, we need you to stand with us. Uh, say, Lord, we need you to agree with us. Uh, oh, glory to God. Uh, break every chain this morning. Uh, undo every prayer. Burden. Uh, let every oppressed go free. Bind up every demons and devil. Cramp and paralyze every plan of the enemy. Oh, glory to God. Uh, as your people walk through the door, uh, let a special anointing uh, overtake them this morning. Uh, leave no stone and turn. Uh, oh, glory to God. Uh, let the peace of God, uh, which passes all understanding, uh, tabernacle with us today. God, remember your servants. Uh, oh God, the task is greater. Uh, but God, you give them a mandate, God. Uh, and you is able to keep them. Uh, oh, glory to God. Uh, you have given them a charge. Uh, and God, they stick with you. Uh, and as long as they remain loyal and faithful, uh, you will never let them down. Uh, so I commit them again this morning. Uh, into your hands again God uh, wrap them around you Holy Spirit uh, oh God oh God oh God uh, yesterday anointing will not work for today each day they need a double portion God uh, because God they have to give so much uh, so many are depending on them uh, because they are a father and a mother they care for the children children uh, oh glory to god uh, lord i pray this morning uh, that you will strengthen them afresh uh, remember them god remember their immediate family oh spirit of the living god uh, continue to uphold them uh, continue god to walk with them uh, continue to talk with them uh, wherever they go go before them uh, let there be special favor whatever they are seeking you for god uh, that have not yet accomplished uh, i pray in the name of jesus uh, lord god in the name of jesus uh, in the mighty name of jesus uh, oh god come true for them uh, come true holy ghost of god uh, let there be a breakthrough uh, oh god uh, remember our assistant minister minister note man this morning uh, strength the woman of god uh, remember all our ministers uh, lay your hands upon them uh, as they hold up the hands of your servant uh, oh god almighty let there be no division uh, let there be no separation among them uh, but let the spirit of oneness uh, the spirit of unity god uh, in the name of
Oh God, uh, Lord, you tell us in your word uh, that God, we are your people that call by your name. Uh, if we humble ourselves uh, and seek your face, uh, God Almighty, you will open your heavens uh, and you will pour out uh, upon us, oh God. So as your people deal this morning, uh, Oh God, Holy Spirit, come by your Lord, come by your daddy, come by your, let the anointing flow like never before, oh God, curfew this morning from the rustum to the pew. Oh God, <laughs> many are still on their way. We ask for complete coverage. <laughs> Let there be no accident, God. <laughs> Those that are watching, those that are browsing, uh, those that are viewing this morning, uh, God, God, you know where they are sitting, uh, you know where they are standing, God. Uh, so maybe on the job with a earphone in other ears, uh, oh God, oh God, oh God, uh, Lord, come through this morning, uh, speak, <laughs> speak in every area God you know we are your people need your most Lord anoint your servant today with the word Lord let the word come forth God like never before Lord Jesus Christ Lord whatever need to change change it God whatever special you need to happen here today intervene God we are open to you oh glory to God come and dwell with us God Holy Spirit of God have your way this morning hallelujah glory to God hallelujah somebody might be sick among us God somebody might be saying she asked me to kneel I can't even kneel Lord God whatever that condition is even right now, God, as your people kneel, let sinews flow again. Let the anointing penetrate to those bones this morning. From the crown of our head to the sole of our feet, God, take away the pain and the ache and the discomfort. Oh, glory to God, and let worship be easy. Glory, 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 glory. Thank you, Lord. We thank you. Spirit of the living God. Fall afresh among us this morning. Have thine own way. Have thine own way. Have thine own way, Lord. Have thine own way. You are all potter this morning. We are only clay. Break and make us again oh God take us back to the potter's house where we need to meet again oh God Holy Spirit of God this morning oh God oh God oh God anoint every warrior this morning remember warriors oh God Holy Spirit of God let a double portion of your anointing rest upon them God as they intercede oh God many can't even manage the fasting again but they are trying their best God and do what they can so God pray that you will strengthen them oh God as they cry out to you Lord say them 
Baba Kondosa Ribo Satara Bahaya Rido Boko Sedibia Mando Boko Sataya Baha Ribo Bushekedi to you, Jesus, 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 Jesus. But if this morning uh, many may be at home even know uh, who plan to be here, uh, but circumstances beyond their control, uh, they have to remain in the house. Uh, so I pray, Holy Spirit, uh, that you will turn things around. Uh, oh God, anoint the praise and worship this morning. Uh, anoint the musician. Uh, remember the solo is God. Uh, if there is a testimony in the house uh, oh God uh, Lord do it again uh, do it again Lord do it again uh, let the revival burst out today Lord as we worship you let fire shut up uh, in every bone this morning uh, let no stone and turn uh, God even those on the outside uh, will have to drop the water pot uh, and shout hallelujah those in the canteen God uh, will have to bow down uh, and worship you this morning uh, oh God those uh, over lot 14 uh, Lord Jesus Christ uh, let there be a presence uh, that we cannot contain in God uh, because you alone is worthy oh God uh, Lord God every building uh, that surround uh, this complex God uh, let your presence uh, all of our she was a Narabaya, Urobo Sata, Yera Babaku Setere, Mandoraboko Saya. Let your presence break forth, O God, Yeribio. Lord, O God, O God, O God, Spirit of the Living God. Oh God, fall afresh, fall afresh this morning. Oh God, let those who are at home comfortable run to the house, God. Lord God, I was on the road Monday and I've seen so many people running up and down. Lord Jesus Christ, it could be otherwise, but the smart in God, if you are put in your appearance on Monday, God, so many lives would be lost, but we are still here saying, Lord, be merciful, God, say the help, Lord, say the help, say the help this morning, as your people seek you, oh God. Let's 
somebody say, Lord, I surrender. Let somebody come to the house for the last time and leave the way they came, oh God. Let there be a newness. Let there be a wave of your presence, oh God. Yeah, daddy, 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 daddy. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. The Spirit of the living God. Do it again, Lord. Do it again. 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 Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, glory. Rikondo Satayaba Robo Sikuribie Mandarabako Sa Yerabako Ribiende God We make a miracle worker Promise keeper Lion of the tribe of Judah Break chain this morning Jesus, hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah, he's in the house, he's here to bless, he's here to deliver, he's here to set free, he's here to break you up. he's here to undo every burden, he's here for the oppressed to go free, he's here to bind up, Arabako Sata, Jesus, we thank you. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, oh God, we thank you. Do 
those that are sitting, please stand. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hold hands with one person. Face somebody individual this morning. Glory to God. We are still in the Ely family, Ely nation. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Just turn one to one. Hold both hands this morning. You are going to be praying for the family. Hallelujah. You might not know the person on your own, but you will be praying for that person family this morning. Glory to God. Families are under attack. Lord of mercy. Some people may not cheer, but people box are against the wall because their family is going through a certain kind. Oh God, God, God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Pray like never before. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. God, hallelujah, glory to God. Jesus, hallelujah, Jesus, hey, hallelujah, hey, hallelujah, Jesus, 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 Jesus. Jesus, 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 we pray this morning, Father, in the name of Jesus, in your presence I come one more time, Almighty God, I come to worship you, to praise you, and to honor you, and to glorify you, and to lift you up and place you in the highest place this morning. God, you are the great high priest, and you can be touched with the feet of, of our infirmities. Father, right now I pray for the family of Missionary Barrett, Missionary Parish right now. I pray for her husband. I pray for her children. I pray for her in-laws. I pray for the children, grandchildren. In the name of Jesus, cover her husband and mighty God. Lord, you just cover our children, cover our daughters, cover our son-in-laws in the name of Jesus. Cover our grandchildren in the name of Jesus. They may be at school. I pray may cover them at school. They may be at work. Cover them at work in the name of Jesus. Total blood coverage for them, Almighty God. Cover their homes. I pray to may bless them when they go out and bless them when they return. Bless them in their homes, Almighty God. Bless them on the job in the name of Jesus. Oh, glory to God. I pray to may bless them going out. I pray may bless them coming in in the name of Jesus. I pray for your protection. I pray for your guidance in the name of Jesus. Reach out your nail scarred hands, hallelujah. And I pray to may you cover them and touch them and protect them. Creep the plans of the enemy towards their life. Creep the plans of the devil towards their life. I pray that you may promote them, Almighty God. Because promotion will come from man. It comes from you, God. You 
now to lay down one and raise up another in the name of Jesus. So I pray for our daughters right now. They may be on the job. I pray to cover them. Total blood coverage. I pray for the grandchildren, those that are at school, and if there's any at home, I pray to assign the angels, assign the angels to watch over them. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Almighty God of Daniel, Lord, stand by them. Almighty God, wrap your arms around them. In the name of Jesus, let no evil come near their dwelling. Let no evil, no plague come near the Almighty God. In the mighty name of Jesus, Spirit of the living God, Spirit of the living God, Spirit of the living God, fall afresh on this woman of God this morning. In the name of Jesus, anoint her afresh, O oh God. In the name of Jesus, anoint her from the crown of her head to the sole of her feet. Let her anointing flow upon this woman of God this morning. In the name of Jesus, I pray, Almighty God for the family, every family in this house today, God, every family, my God, every family, every household that is represented in this house, cover them, Almighty God, every husband, every wife, every child, every children as covered right now in the name of Jesus, under your blood, under your blood, Jesus, under your blood, Jesus, under your blood, Elobo Shatalabababasitolaboshanda, under your blood, Riboko Shata, under your blood, Jesus, under your blood, the blood of Jesus, the blood of Aludis power, that the same power and in olden days, the same blood that was shed almost 2,000 years ago, the same blood of Jesus, it washes whiter than snow, once I'm right aside, what can wash away my stain, nothing but the blood of Jesus, what can make me whole again, nothing but the blood of Jesus, so Father God right now cover us under your blood, when we leave this place today, God cover us, cover every home, Almighty God, that is represented here today, God Almighty, in the name of Jesus, where your name has been called, in the name of Jesus, I pray for an unsaved husband, I pray for an unsaved wife, in the mighty name of Jesus, I pray for blood coverage for your people, in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost, Rebo Shata, Rebo Shata Labasata, Rabba Baba Basi Kolobo Shanda, Rebo Kondolobo Shata Lababa Basata, Rebo Shanda Lababa Basi Kolobo Shata Laba, Rebo Kondolobo Shi Kolobo Sata, Rabba Basi Tolobo Shakada Baba Basata. In the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, total blood coverage, Lord, for this congregation. Total blood coverage, total blood coverage. Every son, every daughter, every grandchild is covered this morning. God, here in the classroom, cover them, Jesus. Lord, some of them are at home because of the earthquake. My God, they have been staying home, but I pray to cover them, God. Blood coverage for your people, wherever they go, Jesus, blood coverage, in the name of Jesus. Hey, Holy Ghost of God, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost of God. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Glory to God, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to God, hallelujah. Glory. 
glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Shout a thank you, Jesus. Shout a thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Let me greet one and all this morning again. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let me greet our Bishop, Bishop Davis. And Minister Davis, all our ministers, all our officers, saints in Christ. Hallelujah. Prayer leader, our prayer leader, evangelist, Ro. She's not here this morning. We greet you well, Mama. Evangelist Foster, you're truly, hallelujah. All warriors, hallelujah. Servant leaders, those that are viewing, those that are browsing, I greet you this morning. This is our first Wednesday fasting. Glory to God. And we are here to pull down and to destroy uh, that which the enemy glory to God have set up uh, glory to God so we just want to greet you in the mighty name of Jesus this morning uh, and let you know the bet the best uh, is yet to come uh, hallelujah put those hands together clap them for the Lord hallelujah glory to God hallelujah glory to God hallelujah I don't know how you're Seat. I did not say be seated. Come on, man. We are in war. Glory to God. You cannot fight back the sitting. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mm. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Come on. Hallelujah. Manamoko Sata. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Not my will, but I.
my will, not my will, not my will, Lord Jesus, not my will, but I be done, glory to God, hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. I'm going to ask 11. This month represents the 11th month. I'm going to ask 11 warriors to come out here. Hallelujah. 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 Jesus, a level warriors. Oh God. Mm. Mm. Somebody say, mm. Jesus, Jesus. Oh God. Somebody here represent January. Somebody represent February. Somebody represent March. Somebody represent April. Somebody represent May. Somebody represent June. Somebody represent July. Somebody represent August. Somebody represent September. Somebody represent October. And somebody November. We are going to cry again. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We may not see it happen as yet. And we are saying, Lord, it's the 11th month. When is it going to come true? This morning I'm here to tell you that it is finished. The battle is over. It is finished. The battle is over. It is finished.
must come down this morning. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. It is finished. Jesus. Jesus, 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 enough is enough, enough is enough, enough is enough, Jesus, 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 glory to God. Thank you. 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 should be nobody looking around. There's a presence in the house. Go ahead and tap in. This might be your time. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Oh God. Jesus. 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 Hey. Jesus. Be still. I know that I am God. Be Hallelujah, Lord. Be still and know that God is God. We exalt you this morning, Almighty God. We lift up your name this morning, Almighty God. We glorify you this morning, O God. There is none like you, Lord. And there is none to be compared, O God. You are God all by yourself this morning, Almighty God. You sit high, God, and you look low, Almighty God. Be all in the good and the evil, Almighty God. We worship you this morning, God. We honor you this morning, God. King of all kings, Almighty God. Lords of all lords, Almighty God. Conquering lion this morning of the tribe of Judea. Roar this morning, God. You are in control this morning, Almighty God. We place you, Almighty God, at the highest place this morning, Almighty God. Take over this morning, Lord Jesus. Take up resident this morning, Holy Ghost of God. Take over this atmosphere, Almighty God. Show up in a mighty way this morning. Lord, your people them are here this morning. Lord God, you know what they are here about, God. Some hearts are broken that need to be mended. Lord God Almighty, some need to be strengthened. Strengthen those that need to be strengthened.
strengthen. Lift up those that are falling, Almighty God. Do a new thing this morning, God. Let there be a mighty move this morning. Move, Holy Ghost, move. Move, Holy Ghost, move. Show up in this place this morning. Break everything that needs to be break. Root up everything that needs to be root up. Destroy everything that needs to be destroyed. Lord God, we call on you this morning. You are the deliverer this morning. You are the way maker this morning. You are the bomb in Gilead this morning. You are the comforter this morning. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, your children, them is depending on you this morning. Lord God Almighty, they come. Lord God, with their cups turn up. Lord God, let none be denied this morning. Let none be denied this day, Almighty God. Show up, Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Overturn every table, Lord God Almighty. Break every powers of hell this morning. Everything that have your people in bound. Lord God Almighty, we lose them this morning. We lose this service this morning. We lose it this morning. We lose them to worship. We lose them to pray. We lose them, Almighty God. God to glorify you, Lord God Almighty, Holy Ghost of God. We cannot do it on our own. Lord God, we are nothing without you. Great God of heaven, show up this morning. Show up this morning. Show up in every corner. Show up in every crib. Show up in every situation, Lord God Almighty. Only you alone can do it. Do it, Almighty God. Fix what needs to be fixed. You are the great fix. Sir, fix it this morning, God. We tear down the stronghold them this morning. We tear down the stronghold them, God. We tear down the evil heart of them this morning. We come against every wickedness this morning. In the name of Jesus, Lord God, you say, suffer not a witch to live. Lord God Almighty, we kill every witch this morning in the spirit. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Lord God Almighty, you are the great God. You are the mighty God. You are the powerful God. Show off this dear God. Someone need you this dear God. Someone is crying out this dear God. Someone come for a deliverance this dear God. Someone come for a breakthrough this dear God. Someone come for a word of encouragement this dear God. Lift up your people them God. And lift them up to you this morning God. You know everyone by name. You know everyone by number. God, you know the home where they come from. God, you know the family, God. God, you know the community where they come from. Lord God, you know the heart desire. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you say you're perfect, that which concerns us. So Lord God, do it for someone this morning. Turn it around, God. Shame the enemy, God. Shame him, God. Shame him. Shame him, God. Shame him. Lord God, he might look at him at all, God. And he might say, where we got there? Jesus Christ of Nazareth, come true for your people, them Lord. Come true this morning, Jesus. Come true, Holy Ghost of God. We are depending on you, Lord. We don't know no other God but you. We don't trust in no other God but you. Some trust in chariot and some trust in horses. But Lord God Almighty, we trust in you this morning. We are depending on you this morning. Our hope is on to you this morning, God. Hear our cry this morning as we petition the truth room of heaven this morning as we cry out for help as we cry out for help help on the behalf of our family help on the behalf of our children help on the behalf of our community help on the behalf of our church members lord god we cry out for help help for those who oversee help for those on the network that is listening mighty god help jesus help we cry out for help Loose them, loose them, God, loose them. Show up in a mighty way this morning, God. Let your will be done this morning, God. How we give you the glory, the honor, and the praises. How we tell your thanks for hearing and answering our prayers. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. You can go back to your seat, warriors. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 
Those that are singing, please stand. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Continue to worship Him.
lift to him. It's all about him this morning. Our life is not to our own. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. It was my pleasure serving you this morning. Hallelujah. My name is Missionary Novlet Parish. I now hand over the rest of the servant into the hands of our minister, Minister Dr. Pechova Davis. Put those hands together and make us welcome. And I declare this morning, I will bless the Lord at all times, and his praise shall continually be in my mouth. My soul shall make her boast in the Lord. The humble shall hear thereof and be glad. Oh, magnify the Lord with me, and let us exalt his name together. Just lift your hands above your head with your eyes closed and with your hands raised and with your heart in tune right now. Just give him the glory that is due unto him. Honor the Lord this morning. Lift up his name this morning. He deserves the glory and the honor. I lift my hands in worship this morning and I pray. Glory! 
Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Jesus. Jesus. Sweet anointing. Holy Spirit. Just fill the atmosphere. Glorify yourself, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We worship, we worship, glory to God, thank you Jesus, hallelujah, thank you Holy Spirit, we worship you Lord, this is your day, this is your hour, hallelujah, have your way Jesus, we look to you right now, Jesus, 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 let it go, let it go, let it go, just give it to the Lord, let it go, it's not yours, his worship, his praise, his glory, his honor, belong to him this morning, oh, let his name be praised, let his name be praised this morning, oh, glory to God, Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Spirit of the living God. Yes, Lord. Magnify yourself. Magnify yourself, Jesus. Magnify yourself. Magnify yourself, Lord. We worship, we worship, hallelujah, glory to God. The spirit of the Lord is evident in the house, glory to God. And I just want to be obedient, thank you Jesus. Glory to God, this morning when I was coming, the Holy Spirit rested the song on my heart. And I said I was going to open with it. And I heard the prayer mother start the song before she prayed I'm still gonna do that song be still and know that I am God God want people to know who he is Lord have mercy there are those who fear not God nor regard man they feel as though they contain their own life but God wants us to know that he is God this morning and there is none like him and there is none to be compared and he walks at his own command this morning hallelujah glory to God thank you Jesus we bless your name hallelujah glory to God thank you Jesus we're gonna do this song be still and know that I am God thank you Jesus hallelujah hallelujah hey Jesus glory
action to cease. I want you to get your mind and your spirit lined up this morning. Glory to God. I know you did not leave your home to come here this morning to pass time. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hey, Jesus, Jesus. Just give him the glory. Give him the honor. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Just worship. Just worship. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We bless your name, Jesus. We bless your name, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We bless your name, Jesus. We bless your name, Jesus. We bless your name, Jesus. Glorify yourself again, God. You are lifted up, God, above all else. We place you in the highest place. You are the great high priest this morning. We place you far above all else. And we worship at your feet. We worship, we worship, we worship, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus, 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 yes Lord, yes Lord, glory to God, we honor your presence, we glorify you this morning, you are exalted and high. Shall praise you, the saints shall adore you. You are the only potentate, you are the almighty God. Hallelujah! Glory to God, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Glory to God. The question is asked Shall mortal man be more for God, pure than just than God? Jesus, shall a man be more pure than his maker? Hear God Almighty this morning. We humble ourselves. We prostrate at your feet this morning. We bless you. We bless you. We bless you. We bless you. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus, Jesus. Magnify yourself, God. Magnify yourself. Glory to God. We worship. We worship at your feet. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory. Glory. Hey, Jesus, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus. Glorify yourself, Lord. Magnify yourself. We know that you are God. Hallelujah. And there is none like unto you. None to be compared. The 
this morning. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. We worship. We worship. Hallelujah. to God. Hallelujah. Jesus. Hallelujah. Mm. Hallelujah. Hey, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Yes, Holy Spirit. Hey, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Break every you, Holy Ghost. Destroy every stronghold. Holy Spirit. Holy Ghost, manifest your power, Lord. This is your hour. This is your day of the supernatural. Oh, glory to God. Perform your miracles in the life of your people, God. Pull down strongholds and bring complete deliverance in the name of Jesus. Oh, glory to God. Jesus, mighty God, mighty God, release your power, Lord. Release your power. Yes, Lord Jesus, everything that can be shaken right now, God, mm, in the name of Jesus, we worship, we worship, we worship. Bless the Lord. Jesus, hallelujah, glory to God, God richly bless you, you can either shake somebody's hand or if you want you can hug them and just tell them, Master God of God, Lord Jesus, Master God of God, glory to God, see him in the morning, in the evening, Yes, hallelujah. Glory. Ah, oh, Jesus. Master God of God. Lord Jesus. And there's nothing anyone can do about it. Hey, Jesus, Jesus. Ah, oh, Jesus. He rules. He reigns. He's in control. Ah, oh, Jesus this morning. Ah, oh, he's here. He's here to deliver. He's here to pull up strongholds. He's here to break every yoke. He's here this morning to set the captive free. Hey, Jesus, glory. Mighty God. Hey, Jesus, Jesus. Hey, hey, hey. My God. Hey, Jesus. Iosa. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus. Jesus. Yes, Lord. We worship. We worship. We worship. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hey, Jesus. Hallelujah. Bless your name. Mm. Thank you, Jesus. He rules and reigns. Hallelujah. Mm. Glory to God. God richly bless you. You can have your seats. Oh, we praise him. We praise him. We praise him this morning. We honor him. We adore him. We exalt him. Glory to God. Mm. Hallelujah. Bless.
bless the Lord, oh my soul. Mm. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hey, I want somebody to know this morning that it doesn't matter what you think, who you think you are, and how mighty you think you are. There is a greater power. There is a greater person. And when he manifests, oh, glory to God, as the word of God declares, every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that he's Lord to the glory of God this morning. Hallelujah. We worship. Bless his holy name. God richly bless you. God bless you. Oh, we worship. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. You are worthy. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. I want to extend a very warm and cordial greetings and welcome. Praise God to the set man of the house. Oh, glory to God, our bishop. Apostle Dr. Delford Davis, I want to greet all the ministers that I recognize. We have Minister Bobby Chambers, Minister Gloria Campbell, Minister Otnil Scott. We have our senior assistant pastor, Minister Isilda Noteman. Praise God. We have Minister Michael Smith. We have Minister Vinette Peter. And if there be any other, you are not visible to my eyes. Give our ministers a very big hand this morning. Glory to God. We give God thanks for them and their service that they continue to render to the work of the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I want to put your hands together and give the AV department a very big hand. Praise God for their contribution. And we want to give the engine room of this ministry the prior mothers the intercessors give the prayer mothers a very big hand under the leadership praise god of evangelist jennifer Rowe, evangelist marcia foster and missionary novelette parish who god has used ably this morning to have moderated the service praise god we give god thanks we are workers together in christ and we give God thanks for you that are in the house this morning. We thank you for coming. You could have stayed away. And if you had, we would not be able to have a service. So that's how important you are. And we give God thanks that in spite of the inclement weather, you know what you need from God. And you know the goodness of God. And that's the reason why you are gathered here this morning. Give yourselves a big hand. Thank you, God. Bless you for coming. Praise God unto those and the different media platforms. We want to give God thanks for them. Give our viewers, our browsers, and all those who are out there. Give them a very big hand this morning. We give God thanks for you. We truly appreciate you for what God is doing in the life of the Power of Faith Ministries of this morning. Glory to God. And I just led to read just a few verses, not much from the book of Acts chapter 12. The word of the Lord declared now about the time Herod the king stretched forth his hand to vex the church and he killed James, the brother of John with the sword. And because he saw it pleased the people, the Jew, it, it pleased the Jew, he proceeded further to take Peter also. Then were the days of unleavened bread. And when he had apprehended him, he put him in prison and delivered him to four quadrants of soldiers to keep him intending after Easter to bring him forth to the people. Praise God. But I want to read this verse because this is where I read this morning for my devotional. And the word of the Lord said in verse 20, and Herod was highly displeased with them of Tyre and Sidon and they came with one accord to him and having made 
Blatus, the king's chamberlain, their friend, desire peace because their country was nourished by the king's country. And upon a set day, Herod arrayed in royal apparel and sat upon his throne and made, a, or made an oration unto them. And the people gave a shout saying, it is the voice of a God and not of man. And immediately the angel of the Lord smote him because he gave not God the glory. Mm -hmm. And he was eaten of worms and gave up the ghosts. We have to be careful. Not trouble God people. Leave God people alone. If you don't have good to say about God's people, close your mouth. You will get in trouble with God. Him kill James and it pleased the Jews. And so he take Peter. Glory to God. But he did not know that the church had gathered and was praying for Peter's release. Jesus, glory to God. Hallelujah. And while the church was praying, he intended to get Peter after Easter and to kill him. But you see, God has a way of delivering his people. God has a way of bringing down your Herod. Not fight your Herod. Give him to God. Let God deal with him. When God deal with your Herod, glory to God. Can no man can question God. When God work, it is well done. Jesus, I love you. And don't play with God's glory. Glory belong to God. Hannah belongs to God. And sometimes man won't cross over the boundary. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And God has a way of delivering your enemy. And so when he thought everything was good. Array himself in his royal apparel. And stood out there. And made an oration and give a speech. And the people said, this is not the voice of man. This is the voice of a God. And he refrained from giving God the glory. And God allowed worm. The angel of the Lord God. Make worm eat him alive. Until he was dead. Let us be careful. Not trouble God church. Don't trouble God's people. You'll get in trouble with God. We don't fight with stick and stone. We don't fight with carnal weapon. We fight on our knees. Because when the people of God get on their knees and pray, it's no telling what is going to happen. Glory to God. So don't contend with anybody. Don't quarrel with anybody. Don't fight with anybody. Even if you hear certain remarks that they will pass against you. Don't contend with them. Leave judgment to God. Get on your knees. Let the Lord fight your battle. Ah, oh, Jesus. So I leave this word with you. Master God, a God, see him God in the morning, see him God in the evening. Master God, a God, let the Lord fight your battles. You can't lose when God fights your battle. You'll just stand up 
and see the salvation of the Lord glory to God the Egyptians you see today you shall see them no more because God is going to take care of your battles God bless you this morning God keep you the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious unto you God bless you God bless you praise God hallelujah hallelujah thank you Jesus we worship you hallelujah we have the ministers well a few of them this morning in the house I'm gonna segment them in two segments I'm gonna take three first and then afterward I'll take the others at this time I'm gonna be asking whoever is comfortable and want to greet the church I'm gonna ask you to come at this time I'm gonna take three and then I'll take another three or four so ministers who are here just come right now I need three ministers to come and give us a warm greetings praise God Shall we praise the Lord? Let me hear the people of God praise Him. Stand on your feet and praise your God. Let us praise God today. He's worthy to be praised. Glory to God. God bless you. You may be seated. Let me greet our bishop. Bishop Dr. Davis, Minister Dr. Petrova Davis, all the ministers in the house, children of God, every person in the hearing of my voice, all those that are viewing from the media platform. Let me greet you all this morning in the precious name of Jesus. I want to let you know that today we are blessed to be in the house of God. And I want to join my voice with that of Dr. Petrova Davis by saying, I will bless the Lord at all times, and his praise shall continually be in my mouth. My soul shall make her boast in the Lord. The humble shall hear thereof and be glad. Children of God, stand on your feet and magnify the Lord with me. Magnify God. Hey, glory to God. God bless you, children of God. Continue to serve God. Our minister said, Master God of God. We serve a God that never lost a battle. No matter how rough it gets, trust him. God bless you. I love you all. In Jesus' name. Minister Campbell, maybe you want to bless the Lord a little more. One of our viewers, because she's viewing now from New Jersey. The office gave me this envelope from her to give you. She wants me to call her name. Maybe you know her. She's Rosemary Roden McFarlane. You know that person? You sure? All right. The Lord bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah to the Lamb. Come on, give her glory. Praise ye the Lord, somebody. Are you willing to give God thanks? He's worthy to be praised. 
thank God for this morning. Amen. We're almost under the weather. But thank God, let me give thanks to God for his servant. Amen. Dr. Petrova Davis, Dr. Davis, and all my wonderful colleagues. Thank God for your prayer, mothers. Thank God for everybody. When Jesus was on the cross, he prayed one prayer. Father, forgive them. Forgive them. But that is not what fascinated me. When he said, Father, forgive them. They know not. Don't know. They thought they know. All when the judgment of God is hitting, they don't know. That what come across me. When Saul was destroying the children of God, he met Jesus, by the way. When he met Jesus, amen, he called him by his name, Saul. Saul, Saul, why persecutors don't mean it is hard for you to kick. He said, who art thou, Lord? Didn't know. I said, didn't know. When you know, you turn your life over to the Lord. Some people don't know today. And Monday morning when I was going on the road, and I feel the earthquake, I feel a sort of one place. Like the earth is going to open. Don't know. The day is coming. Amen. We need a root, not branch. It's going to leave. Many people running out of the place. But thank God. Be firm in God. Believer. God bless you. In Jesus name. Hallelujah. I have a prayer. Hey, a precious friend. Oh, how he loves me. He says his love will never
Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Uh, I want to greet my bishop, Bishop Dr. Delford Davis, and his precious wife, Dr. Petrova Davis, all the ministers, all the officers, all the members, all the visitors, and those that are watching. I greet you in no other name but in the powerful and wonderful name of Jesus Christ. I have a friend. I don't care if I don't have no other friend. Come on, church, come on. I don't care if I don't have any other friend. Mm -hmm. I have a friend. Hallelujah. His name is Jesus. He walks with me and he talks with me and he tells me I am his own. Hallelujah. I love him, I love him, I love him, I love him, I love him. Good God Almighty. The longer you serve him, the sweeter he grows. I'm proving him every day more and more, even when I don't deserve it. But yet, Jesus Christ do some things. When, when the earthquake on Monday, <laughs> I was sitting on my veranda hmm. and I heard and I feel, I hear the rocking and I see the light post over my, right at my gate. It begin to sway, it begin to go this way and that way, hallelujah. And I just sit down, I didn't move. God Almighty, and I just call an Almighty God, hallelujah, because he got the power, he is in charge, hallelujah. I see people running up and down on my street, but I didn't move, because I know in whom I'm believing, and I am persuaded that he is able Hey, to keep us, to protect us, to cover us. Brethren, we are in the last days. Look up. The word of God say, redemption, draw it nigh. Strengthen those things that are about to die. Mm -hmm. No, look and take it simple it's not simple god had spared us again we don't know what is next but my eyes are upon him keep your eyes upon the eastern sky lift up your heads redemption Try it now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. We are in a race and we must finish the race. We must finish it well. We are not going to be cheating, but we're going to finish the race well. Is that amen? Just as the earthquake, it could be the coming of the Lord Jesus Christ. Question is, would we be ready to meet him? Prepare your hearts. Love you. God bless you in Jesus. 
Just wave your hands in his presence again. Worship the Lord. Worship the Lord. Worship the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We're going to be blessed at this time with a singing ministry. I don't see Minister Leon Edwards. He's here. Praise God. We are giving God thanks for him. He has been a blessing and so many occasion. And this morning he's coming again to serenade us and to bring us, usher us in the very presence of the Lord. Put your hands together and give Minister Leon Edwards a warm welcome. Praise God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Somebody will praise the Lord. Somebody just praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody give the Lord glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord. And this morning, I want what I do speak for me. I don't know about you. May the life I live speak for me.
sometimes it may seems like seems like it seems like there is no desire it's my desire that the life I live will speak for me that the work I do it will speak for me but more than all when my work on earth is done I want to hear Jesus well done good and faithful servant you have been faithful over a few things and I will make you enter into the joy of my Lord is that's my prayer and I hope it is your prayer too hallelujah to Jesus I stood in the cold room the judge turned my way said it looks like I have no 
Say, mercy, mercy. Say, mercy. 
up this time we are entering glory to God into the territories oh God of principalities and powers glory to God hallelujah the anointing of God to destroy every evil forces every diabolic spirits every forces of hell we are going in and we are delivering God's lawful captive glory to God captives this afternoon Jesus we're going to enter in our noonday prayer at this time evangelist Nadine Thomas is coming to pray this deliverance prayer glory to God hallelujah hey Jesus 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 Jesus, 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 Jesus. Hallelujah. Hey, Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah. Hey, Jesus.
Jesus. I release the seventh spirit of God in this place. The spirit of the Lord. The spirit of light. The spirit of power. The spirit of counsel. The spirit of wisdom. The spirit of knowledge. The spirit of understanding. And the fear of the Lord. Hallelujah. Jesus. Hey, glory to God. For I reckon that the sufferings of this time are not worthy to compare to the glory that shall be revealed in us. I call God, Jesus, Father God, John says in Revelation 12, I saw a wonder in heaven, a woman clothed with the sun and the moon and the earth feet. Hallelujah, Jesus, I God, hey Jesus, with 12 stars on a crown upon her head, I God, and she being with child, prevail in pain, travailing, waiting to be delivered. And he said, I saw another wonder in heaven, a great red dragon, a glory to God, having seven heads and ten horns, with seven crowns upon his head. To the third part of heaven, upon the earth, and he stood before the woman, oh God, that was waiting to give birth, but it says she gave birth to a man child, and he was caught up to heaven, hallelujah, hallelujah, verse 7 declare, and there was a war in heaven. Michael and the archangel fight. Oh, glory to God. And the great dragon and his angel fought, but prevailed not. Hallelujah. But was caught out upon the earth. And the angel said, Woe unto the inhabitants of the earth. There's a war going on, and it's for soul. Lord Jesus, I stand God like Michael and the archangel in heaven. God, we the church stand in unison. Oh God, all the church of this nation, the church in the world. Yeah. <laughs> 
Remember God or you weep over Jerusalem because you saw what would have happened, God. So you weep, you intercede for God. I intercede over Jamaica and the world at large. And the world at large, God, I travel, mighty God, in the mighty name of Jesus, God, there is a eunuch in the wilderness waiting for a Philip to preach your word, Lord, there is a Nicodemus that is confused, that need to hear your word, Lord. Climbing 
kingdom. God, let hell tremble in the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hey, 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 hey. I will proceed. Is there any of the other ministers that would like to share? Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, glory. His presence. Just wave your hand in His. Oh, God, there's an awesome anointing in the house. Just go ahead and worship. Lord, we praise you. We praise you. Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We just bless him. We exalt him. We magnify him. We give him all the glory. We lift him up. Because he's higher than the highest. He's greater than the greatest. 
hallelujah no one can take his crown away and so when we come into his presence we just come to worship the king of kings hallelujah and just give him glory for who he is hallelujah if we came here to give him glory today just praise him in the house hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus we give you to greet our pastor Bishop Dr. Delford Davis and his lovely wife Minister Dr. Petrova Davis all the ministerial staff all the workers all the ushers we are in the presence of God those who are viewing I hope you are enjoying this feast today hallelujah we give God thanks for you and we bless the name of Jesus. Psalm 122 verse 1 said, I was glad when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. There is nowhere else we can experience what we are experiencing at this time. Hallelujah. If you are experiencing the presence of God, just give him a shout of praise. Hallelujah. He is in the house. Hallelujah. Accept Christian greetings from the throne of God. Stay tuned in the spirit. Let the presence of God continue to engulf you and lead us. And so by the time the service ends today, all of us would have received what we came here for. God bless you. God keep you in Jesus' mighty name. Praise the Lord. Come on, somebody give God a praise in the house. Come on, wave those hands and praise the Lord. Come on, say hallelujah. Come on, say it one more time, hallelujah. Jump up on your feet and say hallelujah. 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 
what a mighty God we serve. Hallelujah. Let me take time out to greet my pastor, Bishop Dr. Delpha Davis and his wife, Minister Dr. Petrova Davis. I greet our senior assistant pastor, Minister Isil the Noteman. My ministerial colleagues, I greet you well. I greet the prior workers, I greet the visitors, the viewers, and those all department, the dedicated servant leaders. I greet you in the matchless name of Jesus, our soon coming King. I said, he's in the house. He's in the house. He's in the house. And when he was unhurt anywhere Jesus went, he did good. So I know that today is no exceptional day. He will be doing good to us today. Amen. Amen. Psalm 116 verse 12 said, What shall I render unto the Lord for all his benefits towards me? I will take up the cup of salvation and I call upon the name of the Lord. I'll pay my vows in the presence of his people. And that is a prayer of my heart today. Stay in the spirit, brethren. Stay in tune with God. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Praise God. Hallelujah. We worship the Lord again. Hallelujah. I want to say the water is troubled. I don't know how many of you are in the spirit, but today is a very extra special day. Today is a day of God's supernatural anointing. Glory to God, hallelujah. Ah, oh, Jesus, don't program your mind. Whenever the spirit of God move, just move with the spirit of God. Hey, you may be sick in your body Lord have mercy glory to God but God wants to heal and show himself mighty today oh glory to God hallelujah thank you Jesus I worship you Lord glory to God we give God thanks again today uh, we have Pastor Boswell Raymond almost becoming a part of the power of faith ministries we give god thanks for him put your hands together as we welcome him this morning and give god thanks this afternoon praise god we are going into another phase another area of ministry it's time for giving we are going to give back to the lord as the lord has blessed us glory to god he said out of out of his own we are going to be giving back to him and he said he shall return to our bosom good measure pressed down shaken together and running over he'll allow men to pour into our bosom we can't beat god's giving because the more we give to him is the more he gives back to us praise god i want you to stand with me now and that which you have brought to give to the lord i want you to hold it in your hands glory to god hallelujah and some of us maybe need to change the note that we took out because God know we can do much better. Hallelujah. We should be giving the Lord the best today. The largest note that you have in your possession today is what you should be giving. The largest note that we have in Jamaica is $5,000. And if you have it today, don't withhold it. Prepare to give it to the Lord and watch God return back to you. Glory to God in an overwhelming way. Praise God. Just hold the offering that you bring to the Lord in your hand. Father, as we lift up our offering, oh God, out of thine own, we are giving back to you today, God. Lord, you promise that you'll pour out unto us good measure pressed down shaken together running over you let men pour into our bosoms oh god as we give oh god many are giving out of their needs lord jesus but today you promise that you shall supply all our needs according to your riches in glory 
by your son Christ Jesus and so now God as we give back a portion out of what you have blessed us with God there are those in business Lord God I pray this year before the year close Lord you will return to them they will not have room enough to receive your blessings Lord some may have goods that God they want to get rid of and it's like it's stagnant but God you're a way maker I pray today God that you will open unto them access and avenues Lord Jesus that people call in Lord for more goods bless the work of your people bless whatever we do God you say it shall prosper so right now God I pronounce an extra special supernatural blessing upon all of us everyone that will stretch forth their hands to give an offering God I pray you'll meet with them in a personal way bless the gifts bless the givers and consecrate both for your glory and we tell you thanks again in Jesus name God's people say amen make sure I'm not going to tell you how much to give today but I want you to give your best that you have you're going to come from the front of the church on the instruction of the ushers you're going to come through the two side aisles and you're going to go back through the center aisles those in the extension we're going to ask you to come first those in the two extensions you're gonna come first and then when you go back to your seats and the, you are finished then the main auditorium will come and give praise God and the worship leaders are gonna give us some very lively chorus as we give unto the Lord out of his own back to him for his glory thank you Jesus praise God yes. Oh, let us sing until the power of the Lord come down.
we worship, we worship, we worship. Hallelujah. Mm. Lord have mercy. If this is earth, oh my God, what heaven is going to be like. Hallelujah. The songwriter declare heaven is better than this. Oh, what joy and bliss. I love the preaching and the testimonies too. But heaven is better than this. Glory to God. Mm, my God, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. God bless you. You can be seated. We worship you, Jesus. Glory to God. A very, very important announcement that I need the attention of everyone. This is not just for Power of Faith Ministries, but this is for all our supporters, our well-wishers, praise God, and all those who have the Power of Faith Ministries at heart. We will be putting on, you know, we celebrate 40 years Praise God of ministry of the power of faith and we'll be putting on a very exquisite and elegant banquet, one with a difference and there's no color scheme, wear whatever you have and you're comfortable with so don't think about because 40 they say it's ruby you're not gonna dress up in a ruby if you can't afford it wear what you have it's a variety it's a mix of all the beautiful colors that will be present so don't think of any color all right there's no color scheme all right you wear what you have all right, so this exquisite and elegant banquet will be on Friday, the 24th of November, 2023. And this will be held at the AC Marriott Hotel. They call it the Rocksteady Ballroom. So the Christians that are, we are going to be there, we are going to do spiritual Rocksteady in the holy ghost lord jesus hallelujah glory to god so we just want you all to be a part of it don't miss it you will regret it praise god so it will be at the marriott's hotel at 38 to 42 lady musgrave road in kingston it will be at 6 p.m all right and Guess what? Our MC mm, will be Minister Ian I.T. Ellis. And I know you know that gentleman. He's good at what he does. He's cut for that craft. So I know he's going to keep you very, very happy. We want it just to be a very relaxing evening. God's people just sit back and just enjoy the blessings of the Lord and with all that we'll be offering we'll be going to have special spot prizes etc 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 I can't give you all of the detail because I want you to be there and the tickets are quite reasonable not like the world the other day this gentleman come from foreign how much they had to pay for the ticket to go one million all we ask for is fifteen thousand dollars all right only fifteen thousand dollars so all of our first wednesdays visitors friends and well wishers who are here this would be the last first wednesday before this function our last first Wednesday will be in December, but this function would have been before December. So if you are here today and you want to buy a ticket, you can just come to me and I will furnish you with your ticket. And I can tell you, you are not going to regret it. All right? It will be an evening of fun, fellowship, and really exquisite. All right? So we look forward to having you one and all. God richly bless you. Before the set man of the house, 
our Bishop Apostle Dr. Delford Davis as David was declared as a man after God's own heart. He loves people and he has a passion for souls. God gave him that special ministry. Praise God. And he preaches with a conviction. He lives what he preach and he preach what he lives. And he's not somebody that believe in double standard. Praise God. He has a conviction. He has a call. And he has a ministry given to him by the Lord Jesus Christ. A Jeremiah call. Glory to God. And so immediately after the power in faith ministry singing group they are going to be coming at this time and immediately after their ministry is true i ask you to stand and receive the man of god and minister michael mirage came in after the acknowledgement god richly bless you sir god bless you praise god Praise the Lord. Just pray. Praise, Praise the Lord. God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. God. Hallelujah. We just want to thank the Lord for his goodness and his mercies. Praise God. It's about three Wednesdays going for. I almost lost my life. But I'm giving God thanks for his grace and his mercy. Still not able to speak properly because there is no... All right. But teeth or no teeth, we are going to sing. Praise God. I give glory and honor. I greet my bishop and his wife. Praise God. All the ministers, prayer warriors, you wonderful saints. God is a good God. His mercy endure forever, and we are still here one more day to give him thanks. Praise God.
bad time. And he's still going to be there for you in a good time. He's a God and never fail. The God of the day. He's still God in the night. time God yes he is may not come when you want him but he'll be there right on time he's an on time God oh what tremendous ministries we have received what precious anointing that flowed what vessels that have been used by the Lord have released the healing oil upon all those who were hoping up to receive the flow of the Holy Spirit in all the things that have been done so far to God be the glory just lift your hand and give him praise give him praise and glory glory to God so we want to celebrate all of God's people in this worship space today and those in other places. We give God thanks for the many blessings that have been and are being poured out in many special ways. They've been poured out through the prayer department through the intercessors, through the music ministries, through the words from the ministers who spoke, through the moderator, through the musicians. We are like the body with many members and each complement the other. Body members do not compete against each other the body would be in disarray but each complements the other and had to the proper optimal functioning of the body from head to toes God be praised so we give God thanks for everybody all of the ministers and all of God's wonderful servants. I'm going to share a message with you that the Holy Spirit laid on my heart. And it is geared maybe mostly towards winning souls, evangelism. Minister Davis just said earlier, that I have a passion for souls. One of my ministry gifts and calling is that of bringing souls to the kingdom of God. And I can't avoid from continuing to maintain that emphasis whenever I minister the word of God. But before I do, let me just remind you and you and all of you concerning the special services that are being held here. Each one is special. 
And just as all they are different flavors and different tastes to different meals, I believe each service carries its own special flavor as the Holy Spirit move upon God's people. So we continue our shutting with God on Friday nights and on Tuesday nights. Wednesdays will be used for the MOP getting to assimilate within this large space, preparing for production 2023 on the 17th of December. So we want you to plan for that. Mark your calendar to share. Now, Sunday, the law tires be first Sunday, maybe the fifth of, of this month. I'm not even sure the date here, fifth. We want you to be here, all Power of Faith members. Try your best. I know some of you have become virtual worshipers by your phone, by your TV, by your tablet, by your whatever. But if you can get here, you should be here. Tell your neighbor, if you can get here on Sunday morning, you ought to be here. You mean so many of you talking and I can't hardly hear you? Tell the people them, let me hear what you tell them, say. If you can be here on Sunday morning, you ought to be here. We are going to have a a war peace service war peace dear god i don't know war peace i ask you to dress accordingly if at all you can the outfit for sunday morning will be red and white or red or white do we understand that clearly okay so you come all red or all white or mix of red and white that's war and peace i showed you from revelation chapter 6 verse 2 and verse 4 about the white horse and the red horse the white horse is a symbol of peace. The red horse is a symbol of war. So we are going to do some warring that will result into the ushering of a peace in your life, in your family, like never before. Oh, praise God. So with all of that i ask everybody we are just concluding our three days fasting today monday tuesday wednesday and thanks to the prayer department for engaging all of this and all those who participated a goshen assembly they are closing out three days today also so if you are in saint elizabeth well they may be further in their service than us you can go by and Bishop Sutton will be a blessing to you. So I'm asking us to do a fast on Friday. Even if you can't do the whole day fast, miss a meal or two. Everybody say Friday. Friday. Yeah, man, miss a meal or two in preparing ourselves for Sunday's onslaught. What did I say, Minister Brian? Onslaught against the powers of darkness. All right, that's about it for me. And I now invite you to turn to the book of St. Luke, the 19th chapter. And the first 10 verses will inform us as to where we go in this message to some extent. And Jesus entered and passed through Jericho. 
And behold, there was a man named Zacchaeus, which was chief among the publicans, and he was rich. Note those two things about Zacchaeus. Number one, he was chief among the tax collectors. Number two, he was rich. And he sought to see Jesus who he was and could not for the press because he was little of stature. And he ran before and climbed up into a sycamore tree to see him for he was to pass that way. And when Jesus came to the place, he looked up and saw him and said unto him, Zacchaeus, make haste and come down for today. I would like to abide at your house. My Bible says, I must abide at thy house. And he made haste and came down and received him joyfully and when they saw it they all murmured saying that he was gone to be guests with a man that is a sinner and Zacchaeus stood and said unto the Lord behold Lord the half of my goods I give to the poor and if I have taken anything from any man by false accusation, I restore him fourfold. And Jesus said unto him, This day is salvation come to this house, for as much as he also is a son of Abraham. For the Son of Man is come, to seek and to save that which was lost. Father, we ask in Jesus' name that you will be pleased to anoint your servant, anoint your word. We know, my God, that your word is quick and powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword. But we know the domains of principalities and powers are standing by to end the flow of your anointing. And to end the two-edged sword from doing its job. But in Jesus' name, we take authority over every such power of darkness. We release the anointing of God in the atmosphere to penetrate everywhere and everyone. In the name of Jesus. I pray that salvation will come to the lost. Healing to the sick. Reclamation to the backslider, strength and encouragement to each believer in this sanctuary and by the many media platforms, oh God, social media, television. I pray that you do your thing, Lord. Have your way. Have your way, Jesus. This is not about us. It's about you and the kingdom of God. So I pray for a manifestation of the kingdom of God in power and in majesty. We look to you now in Jesus' name. Everybody shout amen. amen. All right. We want to speak concerning Jesus. But I want to as ascribe two aspects of Jesus' life to this message. His mission and his message. The man Christ Jesus, his mission and his message. Now it is my belief that all those who are on a particular mission they also most times have a message a message that they carry a message to be delivered those who are country representatives in other countries they name them ambassadors they name them charter affairs they call them all kinds of beautiful names 
They do not just come occupying an office because they are on a mission. They also have a message to deliver. And Bishop Dr. V.T. Williams, my spiritual father, is on record to have said many times over that the message is more important than the messenger. Are oh, you not saying nothing? Because it is the message that informs individual as to what ought to be done or what ought not to be done in order to secure themselves. So Jesus Christ, our Lord, he came on a mission, but he carries a powerful message. The message of the kingdom of God. Somebody say amen. amen. Our ambassadors who are all over the world. They have a message. So while Jesus had been. And, and, and when the Holy Spirit gave this to me. I said my God. This sounds too familiar a text. But he said to me. Remember the spirit of the Lord gives revelation. Everybody say revelation. So while Jesus had been and still is among the most, if not the most controversial figure that this earth has ever seen. And not only the most controversial figure, but I, I believe the most misunderstood person that walked this earth. He was controversial where many people were concerned. And he was also misunderstood by many because they did not understand his mission and neither did they receive his message. They did everything to put him out of commission. But you can't stop God from doing what he wants to do. You cannot stand in the way of God as an endurance. He will move you out. You cannot set up roadblock for God on the Holy Ghost. No Zozo can stand in his way. No state of emergency can stop him. Because the earth is his. The fullness thereof, the world, and everything that dwell therein. Somebody praise God if I'm talking the truth. Controversial misunderstood mistreated mistreated but above all above all i believe he was even grossly misrepresented by those who ought to be his true representative misrepresented I hope today that none of us are not misrepresenting Jesus and his mission and his message to mankind. Because he says to us, hear me, I am going back to where I rightly belong. But the mission and the message continues through all of you. You are my chosen people. You have not chosen me, but I have chosen you, and I have ordained you, I have set you forth to be my ambassadors. I've set you forth to be my mouthpiece. I set you forth to be my feet moving, my eyes seeing, my ears hearing my hands reaching out my heart of compassion i have set you up for all of this oh glory to god somebody praise him if i'm talking the word of god here today hallelujah lift your hand and say i have been set up by the holy ghost what a set up he said, I know you can't do it by yourself. You do not have the ability.
ability you do not have the wisdom the knowledge or the understanding so what I'm going to do I'm going to make sure I place myself within you by the power of the Holy Ghost and you shall receive oh glory to God hallelujah somebody wave your hand in this house because I believe God's going to say something to somebody in a way you've never heard it before. He said, I'm going to make sure I give you power over all the powers of the enemy. I give you power to tread upon every serpent and every scorpion. I give you power so that the gates of hell when it comes against you it shall not prevail oh somebody praise god i feel my preacher coming on me here right now lift your hand and say i got some power holy ghost power Woo! god of heaven so when we go out of there as God's ambassadors when we go out there on mission when we go out there with a message we are not on our own he said I give you the assurance that I'll never leave you oh God somebody should praise God for this somebody should praise God for this in a world that is mixed up with all kinds of evils principalities and powers demons and devils and unclean spirits everywhere opposers opposing you amen and you know that the eternal God said I'll never leave you I'll not forsake you I'll be with you everywhere you go in your hope days I am there in your down days I am there if your back get against the wall I'll be there even when you walk through the valley of the shadow of death wave your hand and praise him prayer warriors wave your hand and praise him everybody even when you walk through the valley of the shadow of death you have nothing to fear why should I not fear Lord because I'm with you and I will guide you I will guide you I will guide you with my eyes all the way from earth to heaven God of heaven I will guide you with my eyes lay your hand on sober and tell them he will guide Praise him like you're in church. Praise him.
praise him like you're in first wins praise him like you're treading up on serpent praise him like you're destroying some scorpion praising like you're liquidating some enemy praise him like you're walking in victory praise him like you know that you're the head and not the tail above not beneath misunderstood mistreated grossly misrepresented by people throughout the ages yet his mission and his message to all mankind has never ceased it has never changed it remains the same hallelujah this Jesus he withstood the test of people he withstood the test of time he withstood the test of season he even withstood the test of the highest degree of all principalities and powers and the rulers of the darkness of this world the evil one took him and tried to defeat him cunningly using the word trying to deceive him oh glory to God somebody give God a praise in this house but the omnipotent God defeated the enemy hallelujah and is declared declared to be the unchanged one the unchangeable one the changeless one the lord and master of all and hebrews chapter 13 and 8 tells me unequivocally said jesus christ the same yesterday and today and forever let the saints of god give him praise world since you and I came here do you know how many people have changed on us since we knew them oh no do you know how many lovers have changed do you know how many church brethren have changed do you know how many apostles and prophets, evangelists, pastors, teachers, elders, deacons, missionary, and no title people? Do you know how many have changed before our very eyes? And if the change were for the better, it would have been wonderful. But when fine gold become dim if you don't know the scripture you don't understand some of my messages when the fine gold become dim what a change what a degeneration are you not saying nothing somebody praise God with me here when a man moves from bronze to silver to gold that's progression Come on, somebody. Lift your hand and say, Lord, take me up the ladder. Take me up the ladder. Take me up the scale. But when one moves from gold to silver to bronze, please, Jamaican athletes, 
don't make that move somebody praise him with me touch your neighbor and tell them do not make that move mm. boy I feel I'm preaching what I soon preach little of your style of preaching okay I'm prepared for everything today give him praise everybody is the same yesterday today and forever unchangeable unchanged the changeless one and it speaks of divine constancy not everybody can maintain constancy not everybody in marriage remain in love until death us do part not everybody in love with Jesus remain until he says, come on, my child. It's the last mile you have trod. Not everybody remain in sync with the leadership of the organization, the leadership of the institution. Not everybody remain firm until the end. People change. Lord Jesus Christ, Bishop, a 33 years me live with this man, yo. God of heaven. You see the last 20 years, Bishop, a pure hell me live in, you know. I've been enduring hell for 20 years. The man bad like a yours. He never start out so you know bishop but bad company listening to the wrong voices taking counsel from the wrong people may good good husband turn satan for me if you live with satan same thing could be said of the what some wives somebody say something now there Touch your neighbor and tell them, don't rush the bishop, don't rush him. No, 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 don't, don't rush me. Number one, I'm a senior citizen, so don't rush me. I must do everything on my own time. Oh, no, Jesus. No, don't, don't, don't rush me. Give him praise, give him praise. Come on. <laughs> Lord, have mercy. Mercy walking, Minister Leon Edwards. We have pleaded our cause, our case. We stood condemned. We had no defense, but mercy walked in. What a beautiful ministry. Give, give the man of God a, a hand clap again. Hallelujah. Now let, let's get into this. So, so he says, I am the unchangeable one. The changeless one. The one who remains constant from with God the Father in the beginning when God spoke me and the world came into being, I remain the very same. Divine constancy, divine immutability can't change. And he says in Malachi chapter 3 and verse 6, I am the Lord, I change not. Give him praise, somebody. That's the reason you can bet your life on him. If he comes through for you or he doesn't come through for you, it doesn't mean that he has changed. It means that because he's the only wise God, he is working all things together for your good, whether you understand it, yes or no. I need to say that again. It means whether he comes through for you, yes or no, he has not changed. He's working things for your good. Oh, glory to God. Give him praise again in the house. Come on. I want you to absorb this message. And as soon get to the real text of Luke 19, take your time. Glory to God. I change not. Hallelujah. He says in Psalm 135 and verse 13, Thy name, O Lord, 
endure it forever and thy memorial O Lord throughout all generations all generations I heard on the news this morning a notable Jamaican that passed died in Miami like others we'll leave him nameless but he's been a public political figure an astute lawyer, barrister, and served in many offices in, in Jamaica. He has passed on. Now, why you say this, Bishop? They are saying a lot of things about him now. He's dead. But this Jesus, are you not saying nothing? His memorial is from everlasting to everlasting. And you'll never stop hearing about Jesus Christ. You will never stop hearing about this man of Galilee. For everywhere he went, he was doing good. They reject him, they despise him, they misuse him, they mistreat him. But that did not stop him from executing God's mission and from declaring God's message to the nations. Somebody praise God if I'm preaching you happy today. Give him praise and glory. So thy name, O Lord, endure it forever. And thy memorial, O Lord, throughout all generations. Thy kingdom is an everlasting kingdom. Everlasting kingdom. And thy dominion endure it throughout all generations he said you want me to tell you something more he says i am alpha lift your hand and say you are alpha and i'm
tell the world has changed and people have changed customs have changed practices have changed politics have changed policies have changed all of those things have changed you Jesus your mission and your message it remains the same and it's not outdated oh no it's relevant ready for the time and ready for the season they remain the same all right bishop Luke 19 what do we see in this text Luke 19 I read you 10 verses Zacchaeus wanted to have an encounter with Jesus wanted to see him this chief man among the tax collectors this rich man wanted to see Jesus but he had some problems maybe two, outstand, two outstanding ones every time he approached Jesus on his on Jesus's mission too many people the crowd too large and they cannot get to even see Jesus too many people problem number one problem number two was real personal he was short in stature short so those two things militated against him can't see him too many people around him I am short but I want to have a meeting now it is my considered view and belief that Jesus and Zacchaeus was on the same page as we say in Jamaica not only did Zacchaeus wanted to see Jesus but Jesus wanted to have a meeting a personal private meeting touch your neighbor and tell them some things are private and personal tell them some meetings are private and personal not in the crowd not among all of the prayer warriors not among all of the church members some of them woo, will be private personal lift your hand and say oh my god i need to have a private personal meeting with you say lord i love the crowd i love the whole heap of people but sometimes they're fast in our business take me aside come to my house sit down with me Jesus is saying to you in the crowd the Messiah Jesus and Zacchaeus minister marriage they were on the same page so oh glory to God somebody praise him with me I don't know who you are today I don't know your station in life I don't know your status in life I don't know your vocation I don't know about you 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 and all of you but whoever you are if you're a taxi man 
Jesus wants to meet with you privately. If you're a banker, Jesus wants to meet with you privately. Baby mothers, baby fathers, Jesus wants to meet with you privately. Most honorable prime minister, Jesus wants to meet with you privately, sir. Most honorable prime minister, Jesus wants to meet with you privately, sir. Leader of the opposition, Jesus wants to meet with you privately. Members of parliament, ministers of government, lawyers and doctors and nurses and teachers, policemen and women. Oh God of heaven, ain't nobody praying me this thing through today. God wants to meet with you personally for a private meeting. He wants to meet with you. Do you want to meet with him? If you want to meet with him, like he wants to meet with you, that meeting is going to take place. Oh, glory to God. Give him praise, somebody. Mm -mm. So right now, wherever you are, remember, he wants to meet with you. So, Zacchaeus began to think, what should I do? I can't be just disappointed all the way every time, every time. I must can devise a method, a way in which I could see Jesus. Somebody give him praise down here. A rich man, a tax collector, could not see Jesus because of those two things. Question is, what should you do? When obstacles are in your way that you cannot remove, but you really need to see Jesus. What should you do when obstacles are in your way which you cannot remove, but you really need to see Jesus? How do you do? You just call it over and done come on somebody tell your neighbor find another way come on just, just find another way go around the obstacle you're not saying anything over here just find another way are you not with me here Many of us have had to become innovative and creative and think outside of the box in order to get certain things done. Are you still with me, somebody? So tell your neighbor, find another way. Baby mother, it's a long time you want to serve God and the man say, no, nah, I'm married to you. You have to find another way out so you can serve God. Am I making sense, Minister Peter? Yeah, man. Oh, Jesus. Lord, have mercy. Long time your soul is crying out. You're saying as a heart panted after the water broke. So my soul panted after thee. My soul thirst for God. But you are tied down, wrapped down, put down. By a baby father. By a boyfriend. Buy a baby mother, buy a girlfriend, buy some family members, buy a husband, buy a wife. Find another way. You cannot afford to lose your soul. Wave your hand, everybody. Say, so find another way. That's <laughs> what Zacchaeus did. So Zacchaeus did. We went to Israel, sir. You were there. 
Dr. Petrova was there. We went into Jericho and we saw the tree. We, we, we stood up right beside the tree. This is Zacchaeus climb. A massive tree. The trunk of the tree bigger than anything around this place. Because thousands of years old. I don't know how it survived. Am I talking the truth? Are you going to see it with your eyes, man? This was a tree that Zacchaeus climbed. He said, Jesus, still did it. It is still there. So he found a way. He said, down the road where Jesus is going, there's a tree that is in the way. And I'm going to go ahead of this crowd and I'm going to climb up into this tree because Jesus is going to pass right under this tree. There's no way he can miss me because this is an unusual move. Are you not saying nothing? Everybody following behind him are running, strong him. And one man up in a tree, you must stop. You must say, well, go on up there. Are you not with me? We, is enjoy, you're enjoying the preaching so much so you're not saying nothing. You, you are going to pass this way. There's absolutely no way you can pass without recognizing this unprecedented move. I'm out up in a treetop to worship you. Everybody says it is everybody is, is on the ground, but a man is in the tree. Tell your neighbor again, find another way. If one doctor don't work, try another doctor. Am I talking to somebody here? If one solution don't work, try another one. You cannot afford to go down in the situation. Try something else. Lay your hand on your neighbor and tell them the bishop said try something else. Some of you stuck too much. Stuck to the tradition. Stuck to one policy. Stuck to one way of life. Try. bring it down in the middle give him praise and glory I said give him praise and glory Jesus so if he found another way because down in his heart he really wanted to see Jesus and Jesus really wanted to see him his mission is to reach you and his message is to save you to deliver you to heal you to set you free he is not coming on a mission of condemnation he's coming on a mission to seek and to save that which was lost somebody praise him here with me that is great news how on earth could you want to hide away from a person like that how on earth would you you not want to associate with a person like that who wants to save you who wants to heal you who wants to deliver you who wants to set you free and you don't want him As it was in the beginning so shall it be some people say give us Barabbas is Barabbas we want are you not saying nothing it's Barabbas we want kill him crucify him they know not what they do they know not what they've said Jesus so this Jesus was on a saving mission a healing mission a deliverance mission 
He said in John 10 and verse 10, you know it very well. He said, the thief comes to do three things. He also is on a mission. But hear me, brothers and sisters. The mission and the message of Jesus, they are very, very important to the nations of the world. Can you imagine how important Jonah's mission and Jonah's message was to Nineveh? I pray on a particular radio station every Wednesday morning. Some of you may hear me from time to time. This minister said to me, Bishop, do you remember some of the words you used in prayer when you prayed last Wednesday? I said, well, you tell me you were listening. And he said to me, you prayed, you said, Lord, you are going to visit us. But please visit us in mercy, not in judgment. Did you hear those words in the prayer? He said, Lord, you're going to visit us, but please do not visit us in judgment. Visit us in mercy. And the minister said to me, he believes strongly that that prayer touched the heart of God. And what could have been a 7.5? And devastated Jamaica. God just tone it down. Because prayer warriors are praying. Across the nation. Because this messenger. Was listening to the voice of the spirit. And spoke to the heart of God. Some people don't believe those things. But it's alright. You don't have to believe it. Hallelujah. But one thing I know, God is moving. Coming down, coming down.
we have there, sir. Count them. You're a mathematician. Count them. I can't count. How many you got there? 18. Bow your heads, please. In my prayer for this service, the Holy Spirit said to me, make this call for no less than 15 persons who really want to give their life to Jesus Christ. It so happened that you are the ones. And I want you to take this very seriously. God wants to meet with you for a personal private meeting. I got this on my knees. I said, God, you got to give me the release for this. And I just got it. I got 10 more minutes to preach, maybe five. But I couldn't go another minute before I call you. Your heads are bowed, your eyes are closed. You didn't come down for physical healing or for financial blessing. If that's why you come down, come out of the line and let me get the others who want to be saved want to be saved yeah. want to be saved those of you standing down here and you want to be saved lift up your hand let me see it's salvation while you come down you want to be saved lift up your hand if you cannot lift your hands please go back to your seats God am I making this thing plain enough those who cannot lift your hands please go back to your seats I'm under divine instruction count the hands that are raised for me sir and the others please go back to your seat until your healing time come that's what you want Fourteen hands are raised. Who is the other one person? That one person, please go back to your seat. If you think this thing is a joke, you make a sad mistake. We have fifteen hands raised. Keep those hands up there. Put up one of these prayer cloths in the hands up. Each of those 15 hands. Rahab's covenant. This is your scarlet thread. Oh, where's the church? This is your scarlet thread today. Saying, I have made a covenant with my God. And whatever it takes me to make that cross over oh no I don't want to have anybody praying with me here whatever it takes to make the cross over like Zacchaeus did you'll have to do it say after me your heads are bowed your eyes are closed Lord Jesus pray to pray all of you I thank you for today. I thank you for singling me out. This is my private personal meeting with you. Although in the midst of this large crowd. Jesus! I surrender my life to you. And from today. Is it the 1st of November? The first day of November, I surrender my life to Jesus Christ. I'll take up the cross and follow you from today for as long as I live. In Jesus' name.
Father, I pray that your Holy Spirit will seal these unto the day of redemption. Seal them, seal them, seal them. In Jesus' name. All of you, 15 with the prayer cloud, go over that corner there in my left hand. All of you. Minister or counselors, take the names and the telephone number of them, please. Yeah. Take the name and telephone number. On the baptism for the 9th of December, you must be the first people. You must run to this water. Amen. Take their names and a telephone number so we can be in touch with them. Somebody shout and praise God in this house. Go back to your seat. Thank you, ladies. Thank you. Thank you. Your time will come by the help of God. Give him praise. Sit down, please. Five more minutes. Bishop, what kind of service is this? I'm glad you're here to be part of it. Jesus. Jesus' mission. Jesus' message is for the human race. Come on, connect with me. They are doing their thing. Connect with me. Give him praise and glory. Let's finish it. Luke 19. Let's read a few verses and close from verse 4 to 10. And he ran before and climbed up into a sycamore tree to see him. For he was to pass that way. And when Jesus came to the place, he looked up and saw him and said unto him, Zacchaeus! Make haste and come down. For today I must abide at thy house. And he made haste and came down and received him joyfully. And when they saw it, they all murmured saying that he was gone to be guests with a man. That is a sinner. But hear how the sinner confessed. And Zacchaeus stood and said unto the Lord. Behold Lord. The half of my goods I give to the poor. And if I have taken anything from any man by false accusation. I restore him fourfold. And Jesus said unto him. Oh I love it. I love it. Oh, Jesus. The man who decided I must see Jesus. The obstacles are in my way, but I'm going to find another way. Somebody praise God and let me close. Obstacles, but I'm going to find another way. He found another way, Bishop. And when Jesus got to the place, Jesus stopped. Jesus looked up. Jesus called him by name. Jesus said, come down quick. Make haste. And he came down. This day is salvation. Come to this house. For as much as he also is the son of Abraham. For the son of man is come to seek and to save that which was lost that's this mission that's the message for every human being under the hearing of my voice today and whenever make haste I close make haste and do what you must do to see Jesus make haste and do what you must do in order to see Jesus Amen. and welcoming in your home he has a message for you he wants to say to you privately and personally like he said to Zacchaeus this day not tomorrow this day salvation is come to your house Bow your heads with me, please, everybody. 
Father, I don't know what's happening out in this congregation in terms of conviction. I don't know what's happening on television, social media platforms. I do not know the state of anyone's heart. But Holy Spirit, you know. I ask you now to reach out to every single human being and minister to them in your own very special way. Zacchaeus needed to hear those words. You know the words that each one needs to hear. Whisper them to their ears and their hearts. In Jesus' name. Stand with me, please, everybody. Lift up your hands in his presence and give him praise and glory. Come on, worship God. Worship God. Worship God. Worship God. Worship God. Worship him, worship him, his voice makes a difference when he speaks. seated please those in the audience eh, please be seated be seated
All of you standing down here at the altar. I want you to look on me. Yeah, look on me. Most time I tell people don't look on me. But this is one of the times I'm going to say look on me. We are going to practicalize James chapter 5. I'm going to tell you what to say. And if you choose to say it, you say it. James 5 says, Sick among you must call for the elders of the church. And the elder must pray over them. Anoint them with oil in the name of the Lord. And the prior of faith shall save the sick and the Lord shall raise them up you know I tell you all to sit down don't come sister stay in your seat don't come down here stay in your seat don't come there's a no 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 don't think I'm, I'm, I'm being difficult okay I'm just doing what I, I need to do you standing down here you came at the first call I made and I want you to look at me and call me by name and ask me to pray for you you know my name what will say Bishop Davis point your finger on me say it again Where are the ministers? Take your time and make me two lines down the aisles. Take your time. Nobody else joined the line. Nobody else. Yeah, go ahead. I'm going to pray with every one of you. Don't you worry. Stretch it out to the front door if you want. You have now given me authority to enter into your spirit, into your life stretch the line straight down to the front door oh. you have given me the authority according to the word of god to speak into your life god says he will raise you up the prayer of faith if you do not stretch the line straight out so I can operate properly then we'll have to abort it and I will not abort it all those who want to leave if you have to leave I understand please we have another 15 minutes to do this prayer warriors please stand 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 back aside please Nobody else get up out of your seat and join the line. But you can't sanctify the Holy Spirit. Bring me the other bottle of olive oil, Minister Davis. Hallelujah. Problem is some of you don't have no faith. Two ministers take this drug and anoint these people. They're going to anoint you under your neck or on your forehead. Don't pour too much oil on them, so don't wet them up with oil. Bring the other thing for me, please. I'm going to pray over you. Where are my musicians? Where are my worship leaders? Where? Give, me, give me worship songs, please. Lift up your hands in the, in the line. God is in
is any among you sick let him call for the elders of the church let them pray over him anointing him with oil in the name of the Lord and the prayer of faith shall save the sick and the Lord shall raise him up and if he have committed sins they shall be forgiven him James chapter 5 14 and 15 confess your fault one to another pray one for another that he may be healed the effectual fervent prayer of a righteous man avail it much today closes the three days of our fasting and prayer we're going fast friday again god is able to do it for you we have anointed you you have called for me you have given me the authority by the holy spirit I'm not invading your space. You invite me in. So when you lay my hands on you, open up your spirit and receive from God. Bishop, are you going to lay hands on all of these people? Yes. I'm going to do so by the help of God. These two lines. If I tired, I turn over to the ministers and they continue. But lift up your hands in the line, please. Father, in Jesus' name, whatever it is that stand in the way of these people, Shakonda Moloka Setea, whatever sickness, I heard Bishop Sutton say, Lord, doctors are getting too much money from the church. The graveyard is getting too many people too quick. In the name of Jesus. I speak the word into their spirits and by the authority of the name of Jesus Christ I release the virtue that will destroy the works of the enemy Satan the Lord rebuke you the blood is against you take your filthy hands off the authority of, authority of the word is being manifest right now Come on, somebody, open up your spirit. Don't stand up here like you're dumb. Open up your mouth and begin to praise God. Shakunda Moseta. I speak into whatever condition. God, I will not even name any condition. I may leave out some. Every one of them I commit to you and command them to be healed, to be delivered. To be set free by the power of God. Now lift up your hands and begin to praise Him, everybody. Prayer warriors, are you praying this thing? Are you praying this thing out? Shako said, No, no. Okay, Minister Chambers, take it over now. Sing what God wants you to sing. Oh! oh I lay hands on you, you move left, right, and My shout soul, the victory. Whoa, I want a river, but in my soul.
Let's close. Yeah. Zacchaeus got more than he bargained for. And Jesus was able to fulfill his mission and to deliver his message. The Son of Man is come to seek and to save that which was lost. Stand up, please. Let's dismiss you. Father, bless everything that is in this house to be blessed. Every bottle of olive oil, every application letter, every driver's license, bank book, God Almighty, marriage certificate, wedding band, whatever is presented to you now. You know those lives that are challenged by marital issues. God, we ask you to resolve them for your people. Turn it around. Let today be the day. Like you said to Zacchaeus, today, this day, salvation. Come to your house. Thank you for every person participating near and far. Minister to those on television, those on social media platforms. Minister to them now. Home and abroad, near and far. And grant, O oh Lord, that your mission and your message will continue to affect the nations of the world. It does so in the most positive way. Thank you for this 11th month of the year. Thank you for having guided us through the many months that have passed. We commit the remainder to you. And we believe, my God, that all shall be well. As we go from this place as they turn television off and turn laptop and turn off phone and all the devices god let the holy spirit be turned on while everything else is turned off we give you glory praise and honor in jesus name amen amen grace of our lord and savior jesus christ the love of god the father full fellowship and communion of the holy spirit the comforter rest remain and abide with us all 
now and forevermore and God's people say amen at six o'clock this evening there will be a new converts class so all those of you here surrender to the Lord if you can make it back do so and also on Sunday evening God bless you. Thank you for coming. Have a wonderful rest of the day. Bye, social media. Give me Jesus in the morning. Give me Jesus in the evening. Every hour, every day. Oh, give me Jesus. You give me Jesus in the morning. You give me Jesus in the evening. Come and get your tickets for Banquet. Every hour, every day. Minister.